Hey everyone, this is Corey. Today is Monday, June 3rd, and as you may or may not know, the month of June is designated as Pride Month. And to celebrate Pride Month, I'm kicking off my Inspired by Pride video series, where I'll be posting a video message each weekday morning on my Facebook account to help educate others in our communities who may not know what Pride is, as well as inspire and empower those who may be struggling to come out. Just like me when I was growing up in Northwest Ohio, which is actually where I'm standing today. I'll be asking questions in each video, and it would be great if you could add a video message in the comment section below. Now, I know many people hesitate when they hear the word video, but the main purpose with the video message is to make the stories that you tell visible and personal instead of just words on a screen. The video messages are meant to help those who feel they have no visible role models to look up to. This is our opportunity to be visible and to show others that they have a support network, even if it's only online. That they don't have to come out alone or feel invisible like I actually once did. Your messages will help inspire others to be their authentic selves every day. And it may be the only outlet others have to begin their coming out journey. Today I wanted to kick off the Inspired by Pride series with talking about the word pride. And I want to understand what the word pride actually means to you. The dictionary defines pride as a feeling or satisfaction derived from one's own achievements. But the second definition of pride relates to what we will be discussing during the month of June. This version defines pride as confidence and self-respect as expressed by members of a group typically one that has been socially marginalized on the basis of their shared identity, culture, and experience. When I first think of pride, I think back to all the influencers that paved the way for equal rights before me, those people who have made it okay for me to come out and tell my story, people like Harvey Milk, who was the first openly gay official in the state of California who feverishly began fighting for equal rights, and even people like Ellen DeGeneres, who uses her sense of humor on TV to win people over. I am proud to, able, to be able to finally come out of my last closet a month ago when I released my book. I didn't realize just how many closets I needed to come out of. It is the first time in my life I have not had to hide from anyone and I can finally become all of me and not live only as part of me. And now it's your turn. I want to hear what pride means to you. In the comments section below, insert a video response. Now I know this seems like too much work, but it's actually pretty easy. All you need to do is open up your camera app, make sure the video mode is switched on to video, record a video message with your phone horizontal, long way, and then come back to Facebook and insert your video by tapping the camera icon next to the comment section. You'll see it actually below. So thanks for following along. I think this Inspired by Pride series will be able to help many people who are struggling to realize their own identity. I look forward to hearing messages from you and your responses during this month of June, Pride Month. I'll see you again tomorrow. Happy Pride.